Today, we replace the way overdue awning on the large slide out of the motorhome. We ordered the new tarp from uh, Tough Top Awnings. Their facility is just outside Vancouver in Brush Prairie, Washington. Their website gives very easy instructions to how to measure your tarp, your old tarp, and they do the rest. I opted to go with the heavier duty tarp they described as 18 ounce instead of the uh, 15 ounce uh, standard fabric. For more details on that, go to the website. I will leave it in uh, the description if you need it. The thick one goes on the motorhome. Thin one goes on the tube, right? So we got to turn it the other way. For a do-it-yourself job like this, you will need at least two people. Seriously, a third one wouldn't hurt. Two ladders, screwdriver, razor blade, duct tape, lubricant spray, good weather, and most important, lots of patience. So we gotta start on this side. This is gonna start going in first. Uh, we start with the slide out open all the way out. Position your ladders carefully. Remove the anti-bellowing device to clear the slot at the end of the roller tube. Now, with two people, unroll the old fabric carefully. The roller tube is spring-loaded. Keep that in mind. When you reach the end, and with the slot pointing up, slide a pin in the hole on each end of the tube to lock in position so to prevent the spring from unwinding. I used Allen keys as pins. If there are screws on each end of the gutter to keep the tarp into place, remove them. To make it easy to slide out the old tarp from the tube and the gutter rail, spray some lubricant in the track. Then we cut the tarp across the middle from front to back to slide out each side separately. It's much easier this way. Unless you want to save the old tarp for any reason. This thing needs cleaning. Maybe a little caulking too. This is also your chance to clean the top of the slide. You never get to see this part. And check if there's any caulking needed as well. Then I spread the um, aluminum awning rail on the end just a little so it will not rip the new awning and applied some duct tape on the sharp edges on the ends to prevent the new vinyl from ripping as we insert and slide. Now this is the fun part. Start sliding the new tarp very slowly in the gutter rail of the motorhome. Now you pull it. You guide it, I pull it. Not getting caught, right? Add it. Add it. When you get up to the roller tube, start sliding the other end of the new tarp in the roller gutter. Now we start pulling both sides a little each side at a time while the other person feeds it in the gutter slowly so it does not get ripped. This is a slow speed process. Leave your gear box in your brain on first gear. Take your time, pull in, and small sections at a time. That's my best advice to you. Okay, to the other side. Okay, go on this side. This side is smooth. When finally at the end, make sure you have the same amount overhanging on each side of the slide out. Oh, I gotta come more then. That's what we got now. I'm about... Okay. Okay. 
Okay, I can still see the rub a little bit. Hold on. How about now? Even? Now, it's time to unwind the roller. With each person at each end of the tube, turn the tube to release the pressure from the locking pins and pull out the pin while holding the spring-loaded tube from turning. Very important. Then release slowly to allow the roller tube to wind the new tarp on the roller tube evenly. When all done, let the slide out room in and out a few times to make sure the new tarp fabric winds evenly and without wrinkles. Reinstall the uh, anti-billowing device at the one o'clock position for the driver's side and um, anything else you took off, make sure you put it all back on. Now, I know this is easier showing on video than actually doing it, but it is. It is an easy thing to do. You just have to go slow. Don't rush it because you will regret it. Be careful on that ladder. I mean, those ladders are pretty dangerous. And while on the roof, it's very easy to lose balance. So safety first. And you will not regret it. This is a very easy job.